We'll have to hurry or we'll be late for lunch. Oh, sorry I've taken so long getting ready. I was looking for my other silver earring. I left them both on the windowsill and now one seems to have gone missing. Go and have lunch, Mum. We'll look for it. Won't we, Grandpa? Of course. Thank you, Bizu. See you later. Bye. Let's start in the bedroom and then search the whole house. Okay, Zoo. Let's do it. Nothing here, Zoo. Or here. So, where can it be? Hello, all. Mum! Hmm. You're back early. We haven't found your earring yet. How was your lunch? Yeah, I forgot my wallet, so we didn't stop for lunch. So, anyone fancy a snack? Oh, yes, yes please. please. Coming up. <laughs> hmm, I'm running low on milk and butter. Can someone go to Mr. Zoe's? I'll pop along later as we need some cereal as well. You want to come too, Zoo? Yes, please, Grandpa. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I'll get it. Elsie? Hello. Is Zoo in? Yes. Come in. It was by my open window. And now it's gone. It was my birthday present. My favourite silver bracelet. Mum, what if someone took your earring and Elsie's bracelet? Oh, I don't know, Zoo. Why would someone take one earring? I'm sure it's just a coincidence. And both things will turn up very soon. I know. Let's look in the garden to see if they're there. OK, Grandpa. No earring or bracelet here. Let's check your house, Elsie. <laughs> Nothing here either. Well, we had a good look and we didn't find anything. Now, do you want to come to Mr Zoe's with me? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes, then. Hello there. Oh, hello, Mr Zoe. I'll take some of my favourite cereal, please. Oh, and some butter. And a bottle of milk, the extra creamy one with the foil top. You'll have to have a carton. Someone's taken all my bottle tops. Really? What next? Everything silvery seems to be going missing. Zoo's mum's earring's gone. And my bracelet. Oh. Don't you think that's strange, Elsie? Even the bottle tops now, they're silver too. Yes. What's going on? Hmm. Very odd business, Mr Zoe. Hopefully we'll get to the bottom of the mystery soon. Yes. I hope so. Bye. 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 Wow! Look at this, Grandpa. Oh, yes. That's a magpie feather. It's really cool. Yes. Yes, it is. Let me know if you find out anything. I will, Elsie. See you later. Bye.
Hello, you two. You'd best come up here. Mm -hmm. Grandma's favourite brooch is missing now as well. Oh, poor Grandma. She loves that brooch. Coming, Grandma. My brooch! It was right here. I opened the window to let in some air, and then it was gone. Hmm. What's this? <gasps> A feather! Just like before! A magpie feather? Yes! They're the same! You know, Zoo, this might be a clue. We have to check something out in my bird book. OK, Grandpa. Mm. Ah, here we are. Now then, uh, it, ah, it says magpies like shiny objects. Hmm, maybe they like silvery objects. They shine too. But I have a way we can be sure. We need something shiny and big enough so the magpie can see it. Perfect. Now we just have to wait for him to come back. A cheeky one. Oops. Look! It's gone! The magpie must have taken it. We have to see him take the badge. I think I have an idea. This time I'll get you, Mr. Magpie. <laughs> well, I'd never. He really likes shiny things. Hey! Come back! Quick, Zoo! The garden! Stop that bird! What's all the fuss here? The magpie is the culprit. Zoo set a trap and it took his badge. A magpie, of course. They're known for taking shiny objects. Hmm. Look, Elsie. I think that's where your bracelet went. The magpie just took my badge up there. Yes, he's got something shiny in his beak. It's probably got a nest up there. I'll go and fetch the ladder so we can take a look. Thanks. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Magpie. Go. I'm going to keep this very safe from now on. Oh! And Grandma's going to be very happy about this. What is Grandma going to be happy about? Oh, my! Where did you find my brooch? <laughs> the magpie had it in its nest. When I never. Here you go, Elsie. Your bracelet. Thank you. And here are your badges, Zoo. Thanks, Mum. You know, I feel sorry for the magpie. He doesn't have anything shiny now. Maybe if we gave it some tin foil. Tin foil? Good idea, Zoo. I'll go and get some. Here you are. Thanks, Elsie. OK, Pock, take it to the magpie. Well, now that's all done, I think it's time we all had a treat. Especially Zoo for solving the mystery. Hooray! Mmm, yummy! Don't 
Throw it away, Mum. Why? Do you want to keep it? I'm saving this for a magpie. Oh, Zoo. <laughs> <laughs>